Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Heidi and on this video I want to talk about this Aqua de Parma fragrance. This is the packaging. I really like the packaging. It's really nice. This is the bottle. But yeah, I ordered this during the spring event sale at Sephora and this is the 2.5 ounces of toilet. This is not a perfume, this is toilet. And uh, this is sold as unisex, like both men and women are able to wear this fragrance. This was a blind buy from Sephora. Prior to purchasing this and ordering at Sephora's website, I never smelled it. I just went by the description on the site, which describes this to be like almonds and vanilla and to have some florals. Let me spray some on my... I've worn this once before and I remember that after the smell of almonds when it dries down and it's been on my skin for a while all I smell is the vanilla but when I initially spray it on my skin it smells like very fresh it smells clean and it has that almond smell I smell a little bit tiny floral scent in there. It is pretty nice, but like I said, the when it dries down and it's been on my skin for a while, I smell mostly vanilla, which is not bad, but I already have three vanilla fragrances and I think that is more than enough for me, so that's the reason why I didn't included in my Sephora you know haul because I am not sure if I'm going to keep this I it does have that warm and coziness but it also has that fresh clean fragrance to it which makes it really like bright it's really nice but I don't know you guys I don't know whether to keep it or to return it it's really difficult I don't know that's why I'm in the fence. I'm still thinking about it. I might wear it one day and see if I like it or not, if it's growing on me or not, and then I'm going to make a decision whether to return it or not. But right now, I am like, I don't know what to do. Thank God that Sephora has a really good return policy and I'm able to try them out and if I don't like them, I can return them because if that wasn't the case, I would have to, you know, keep this even though I'm not sure whether or not I like it or not. Maybe it's a fragrance that's going to grow on me or not. I don't know. So I just wanted to make a first impressions review on this fragrance because uh, I think it's pretty nice. The description is pretty accurate uh, on my skin. It smells nice, it smells fresh and clean and when it dries down I get just vanilla, like vanilla ice cream basically. That's what this smells like. Um, so yeah, I want to talk about Aqua de Parma because as you probably might have seen like in the first part of the video I was a little hesitant I was thinking about returning it but after trying this on and really really careful consideration I decided to keep it because this really grew on me like it just smells really nice for summer even though like I mentioned, I do have other three vanillas. Those other vanillas are amazing. I love them. But they are pretty warm. They're really nice for like, um, you know, just if you want to feel like really warm and cuddly. This vanilla is a little bit more fresh. And that's pretty difficult, I think, to make vanilla 
feel fresh because uh, they tend to feel more like warm and cozy type of vibe but this one to me it reminds me more of like vanilla ice cream and my other like true vanilla uh, fragrance that it's the Tijoto that one is more like really adult vanilla bean really elegant classy vanilla this one to me it is elegant and classy but it's not the actual vanilla bean this is more like a vanilla italian ice cream like gelato but yeah i really ended up liking this and also it has a little bit of citrusy uh some floral to it it's really nice and uh really nice and fresh and uh, just a little hint of you know the sweet warm vanilla that it has and I don't have a season. Uh, most people would say this would be ideal for like spring or summer, but for me, I would just wear it whenever I feel like it. But yeah, I decided to go ahead and keep it because it was just, uh, it's just really nice and something different than what I have. But yeah, let me spray some on. Yeah, it smells like vanilla ice cream with the vanilla um, cone. Really nice. Probably for the first time in my life, I've had a fragrance that has grown on me uh, where I initially smelled it and I was like, no, I don't really like that. I, you know, I'm not sure. And then as I have been using it more and more, I have grown to love it and really appreciate how different and unique this fragrance is. But yeah guys, I just wanted to stop by and let you guys know that I did end up keeping it. I just grew in love with it and yeah. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. See you on my next video. Bye!